Holy <laughs> shit. That was incredible. That's definitely not from this planet. That's incredible. It's not doing anything for me. This is not military technology. This is something else. You're not gonna get in here. Aside from curiosity, is it human nature to resist whatever the signs say? Most humans somehow do the opposite of what signs are saying. Small and simple things such as parking in a no parking zone or maybe even not placing their phones in silent mode when in cinemas. This definitely makes us wonder why we enjoy doing things that are somehow the opposite of what we are supposed to be doing. However, we cannot always do the opposite, especially when it's something that's mostly known to everyone. Welcome to The Bestest, the channel that provides you the bestest news and videos you should know about. In today's episode, we'll discuss all the places all over the world that you are not allowed to visit. Before we start, please make sure to like and subscribe to our channel and hit the bell to get notifications of our videos. Yes, the curiosity of what's on the other side certainly shows. And as much as we want to travel and explore, there are specific locations and destinations we cannot visit. Among these destinations is Area 51, located in Nevada. This place has been shrouded in complete mystery to the public eye. But it is also a place that's surrounded by a lot of conspiracies and theories of an alien aircraft and all things that the government does not want the public to know. This is due to the intense secrecy around it. Even the government refused to acknowledge its existence until 2013. Well, if you haven't heard of Area 51, then you might want to start scouring the internet for more information and interesting theories about it. We don't know a lot about it and there aren't a lot of facts to go on. It was previously a site used to test aircrafts, which escalated to the whole alien debate way back. However, we do know that Area 51 is a government facility that conducts tests. Yet we still don't know what it conducts tests on or how or even why. Still, America isn't the only country keeping its secrets locked in. In North Korea, they also have Room 39. It's not a shock that the most secretive country in the world also has a secret room. Room 39 was built in the late 1970s. The location of Room 39 is said to be inside the workers' party building in Pyongyang. That is where the secret room takes its name from. What's even more interesting about it are the conspiracies that surround it. The secrecy of the room is among the reasons why we don't have any official data or facts about it. However, it is still believed that it raises funds through a series of both legal and illegal enterprises. Some of the activities that's going on within the room range from counterfeiting to sale of gold, drugs, and even weapons. North Korea's network of companies and businesses have been rumored to contribute over $2 billion a year. Others have speculated how Room 39 is behind the sophisticated counterfeiting of $100 super note bills as well. This just makes you want to see more of Room 39. Number 3 is Snake Island in Brazil. Located around 90 miles off the Sao Paulo, Brazil coast, Snake Island has the most elevated concentration of venomous snakes in the world. The island is domestic to the Golden Lancehead Viper, and almost 2,000 to 4,000 of these profoundly venomous snakes live here, meaning that there's an estimated 1 to 5 snakes each 10 square feet. Home to the foremost venomous snakes within the world, Snake Island is extremely endangered, so there's no going onto the island to clear them out to make it inhabitable. All it would take is one bite from just one of these snakes to kill a human in around an hour. Would you dare? Number 4. Puveglia, Italy the island was utilized to house plague victims within the late 18th century. Those individuals died, which has driven to the conviction that half of the surface of the island is covered with human remains. 
Afterward, Napoleon utilized the island as a weapons cache, since it is so discreet. Anyways, his foes did discover the island, and there was a wicked fight at the location. Within the early 20th century, a mental clinic was opened on site, which was closed almost 40 years later. All of this history has driven to the conviction that the island is haunted. With human remains all over the island and being the hub of enormous Napoleonic fights, the island of Poveglia certainly has seen more than its reasonable share of casualties. Additionally, mental hospitals continuously lead to horror stories. Number 5. Svalbard Global Seed Vault in Norway The Svalbard Global Seed Vault is strategically carved 500 feet inside the side of a nameless mountain in Norway. This vault is home to 4.5 million types of seeds, each type of seed having 500 seeds. Theory suggests that these seeds have been stored for safekeeping in the wake of a doomsday event or localized disaster, in which case these seeds will be used to start the world's ecosystem again. This vault is carefully situated in Norway because it's a cold country and it isn't humid. It is an ideal environment to sustain those seeds. Moreover, Norway is a very trustworthy country globally and is considered a safe and peaceful area. However, no one is allowed to access this vault. Number 6. North Sentinel Island There is a small island that belongs to the Andaman chain called the North Sentinel Island. It is the current home of an isolated and an uncontacted tribe we now call the Sentinelis. The island is strictly prohibited to visitors due to its inhabitants. The Sentinelese get quite violent when it comes to protecting their tribe and their island, despite the many attempts made by anthropologists to create a connection with the tribe. Nothing was ever done. They are proven to kill anyone who tries to get even close, even people who were shipwrecked or stranded. The only time that a relationship with them was ever established was only the Great Coconut Exchange. The Sentinelese have found a great fascination with coconuts, and that became a huge step for both the tribe and the anthropologists. However, the coconut exchange ended as soon as the head anthropologist retired. No direct and concrete relationship was ever established since the language barrier for everyone was harder to overcome. Due to the geography of the North Sentinel Island, this meant for the tribe to be closed off from everyone else. And one thing that you should know, the North Sentinel Island has been occupied by the Sentinelis for around 60,000 years. Due to this fact, the Indian government has declared that no one may visit the island for fear of a handful of things. One, these individuals have no immunity to illnesses from off the island. Within the 1800s, a few anthropologists captured individuals from North Sentinel Island to perform research on them, and the people instantly died of disease. Another reason is that the Indian government feels the need to keep this tribe untouched since there's nothing known about the inhabitants of North Sentinel Island. The truth that they have survived 60,000 years a long time without being interfered by the exterior world is momentous, and the government needs to keep them as such. You may think that you'd want to see how this tribe survives and lives, but no. The restriction is what works best for both parties. If you value your life, you would comply instead, right? But the whole tribe as well as the island definitely piques the whole world's interest and curiosity. Who knew there were so many places we can't even enter? We all know we're not allowed to enter such places for a particular reason, but the information available about all these places are also very limited to the point that maybe one day, we'd be rallying up in front of all these places. But keep in mind that these places definitely pose a great threat to our lives. Do you know more locations that you're not allowed to visit at all? Let us know in the comments section below. Please make sure to like and subscribe to The Bestest and hit the bell to access more of our videos. 
Thank you so much for watching and until our next bestest video.